Hey guys, it's Bang for Buck PC Gamer here. In this video, I'm going to be comparing two reference design NVIDIA cards from the 900 series and the newly 1000 series. So the GTX 980 Ti will be going up against the GTX 1080, but with this video, I'll be overclocking the GTX 980 Ti to the maximum I can with this particular card and trying to see if I can um, beat a stock GTX 1080. So um, let's see what the GTX 980 Ti can do when it's uh, basically at its full potential. So what I'm going to do now is quickly go through my overclocking settings that I use for my GTX 980 Ti. I've had this card for a year. I literally got this card at launch, so I, I do know the maximums of its capabilities. And I know some of you guys will be able to get a higher overclock than this, but you have to bear in mind that each card is different and this is the maximum I can achieve out of this card so uh, my card likes to have a voltage of 35 any more and it becomes unstable not all cards like to have more voltage sometimes more is less um, core clock the maximum I can get out of this is 215 and as for memory I can get up to 450 stable I'm also going to again be using a custom fan profile so basically maximum fan speed is capped at 80% um, and below 50 degrees everything's uh, capped at 35 so it's silent when not using any load and when I'm playing the game it starts to ramp, ramp up um, accordingly so that's pretty much it when it comes to settings and uh, we can see if a overclock GTX 980 Ti can take down a stock GTX 1080.
So as you can see the GTX 980 Ti overclock puts up an almighty battle against the stock GTX 1080 even coming basically close to level on some games like The Witcher 3. But um, with other games like Rise of the Tomb Raider for instance the GTX 1080 still pulls away by a considerable margin so still a decent scrap and the GTX 980 is still showing it's definitely great value for the performance it provides so um, definitely a close um, race between the two cars but the GTX 1080 on average would still come out on top regardless of if a GTX 980 Ti is overclocked. Anyway guys, hopefully you've enjoyed this video and as always, thanks for watching.